NASA is announcing its plan to get human beings on Mars by the early 2030s and then get them home. Hey guys, I'm Patrick Jones and welcome to Buzz 60. Step one is developing the techniques astronauts will need on the International Space Station. Step two is to put those techniques into play by 2025 on an asteroid that will be redirected to orbit the moon. Doesn't snatching an asteroid and moving it near the moon seem like the biggest accomplishment of all? From there, it's off to the red planet, which NASA describes as developing planetary independence, which is a space way of saying, yeah, I'm bi-coastal. But that shows NASA isn't looking at its Mars mission as a one and done. It seems like they're looking to set something up there to eventually use the planet as the hub to go even further into space. The good news for NASA is they've got almost two decades to come up with something that tops That's one small step for man, one giant leap for mankind. With the whole world watching, you don't want an astronaut to get caught up and improvise. The Martian surface appears to be cold and lifeless. Like my ex-wife's heart. <laughs> gotcha. Buzz 60, now you know, pass it on.